What's up guys, Sharky Jello here again. As you guys can see here, I have another perfect in the Ojamas. And in this episode, I'm going to be talking about Obedient School. So recently, a lot of people have been asking me uh, to talk about this card and how this card works in Ojamas. And how it can work in Ojamas in the near future. So, as of now, I haven't found any uses for this card in the Ojama deck. Now, some people have been explaining to me how they've been using the card. Um... From what I see from their findings, they're, they're using the card, uh, they're using it correctly and all this other good stuff, but they're, but the way they're using the card, they have to play crappier cards just to make this card work in Ojamas. Because, to tell you the truth, we only have two, um, damn it, Dueling Network, why does it do that? You see how it's not changing? I hate that. Ugh, my computer is not slow. I don't, I don't know. It's doing awkward. But anyway, guys, uh, we only have two effect monsters, as you guys can see here, blue and red. And uh, if you guys don't know what Obedient School does, I'm going to read it off to you. If you control no monsters, you can special summon three level two or lower beast type, mon beast type effect monsters with different names from your deck. Their effects are negated, and you cannot, and they cannot be destroyed. Bleh, and they are destroyed during the end phase. If you activate this card, you cannot special summon for the rest of the turn except beast type monsters. Now this card is extremely good. It's broken. Its effect is really retarded, and it's going to be a really strong card in the near future. So I do suggest I do suggest you guys pick these cards up. Now what most people are telling me that they're using this card for is to go into their little Ojama play right here. They're blue and red, and then they go into a, a quick sand dial, a quick. Um, Damn it! A quick Gachi Gachi or a quick uh, Digusto Phoenix. Now, some other people have also been using this card to uh, use cards like Polymerization and Super Poly, as you guys can see here, to go into Ojama Knight and uh, mostly Ojama Knight, but it allows you to get uh, to Ojama King a lot quicker also because you get blue on the field and you can just attack with blue to get your searches off, which is. Uh, country and magic so uh, they've been using those cards what I see bad about those is that first of all obedient school doesn't have enough targets for the deck like I said you only have two um, two Ojama cards in the deck that are effect beast and level 2 and one of them you don't even want to summon out with this card because it negates his effect and he doesn't even work with the card because this guy needs to be normal summon or just uh, activate his effect Yes, you can play other beast type monsters, which I will show you right now. Um, oops, no, I don't need that. Bam. What am I putting? Three. <laughs> two. Two. So you have other beast type monsters like your raccoon, uh, your Tintin, and your uh, Pon Poco. I think that's how you say his name. Um, you have really, really solid level two beast type monsters out there. Um, you have your Rikos, you have, you know, your Fables monsters you can splash in there. You have your Tree Otter that you can play also. Your Sea Koala, which uh, becomes a really huge monster uh, because he has 1600 defense and under um, Ojama Country is pretty strong. But, with a, but, like I said, it forces you to play bad cards. And then, as the longer the game goes, if you don't get that um, one turn OTK or that... Uh, or that uh, very crucial play that you're trying to go into, it, it kind of bites you in the ass in the long game. And if you're playing against a really, really, really strong deck that can just play one card and not rely on like 50 other cards to make the card work, uh, you're going to get destroyed relatively easy. So that's why I think um, Obedient School is not that great of a card in Ojamas. Yes, it's a really broken card. And I do see this card being really strong in the future. So uh, tell me what you guys think about this card. Um, if you have any ways to make this card great, or there's anything that I didn't explain about this card that I don't know of, if that you guys do, or like a really broken deck for Ojamas with this card, then please tell me down below. Uh, tell me what you guys think about this card, and uh, you guys should go pick up these cards before they become really expensive. Uh, right now, they're about 3 $4 or so. So go ahead and pick them up. Uh, in the future, this card is going to be really, 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 really freaking strong. And, uh... That's my two cents on Obedience School for you guys that asked me uh, what do I think about this card. So, with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And until next time, guys, I'll see you guys later. Bye.